Welcome to episode 99 of Madhouse Militia Presents After Hours Calls. We wish to give thanks to the following people for helping make the show go, such as Dwight the Janitor, Wasted Memory for RogueServer.com, Dragomir for the Corndown at Corndown.com, or FreeSpeechMotherfucker.com. By the way, we host our show live 10 p.m. Eastern, 7 p.m. Pacific on Friday nights at RogueServer.com forward slash AKSPA. We also wish to thank our patrons, such as Jayad, Ryan T, Travis B, Gold Rust, Gordo, Parkman, Crispy808, MST3 Clay, Fancy Pants, Anonymous, Mr. Turbois, Phone Losers of America, Benjamin, Despicable Dogs, Big Boy Farts, 666, Jesus Penus, and Turbo the High Level Squirrel. Thank you to everyone for supporting the show. You can find out more at immoralhole.com or patreon.com forward slash madhouse militia. You can find our YouTube at Madhouse Militia and our TikTok at Immoral Hole. If you wish to contribute to the show, you can visit immoralhole.com forward slash show forward slash contribute. You can find our show archives at travelswithmiriam.com. Hotel Park Central, this is Cindy. How may I assist you? Hello, can you hear me? Yes, how can I assist you? Hello. Um, ich bin Johan. I'm in America for the first time and staying with you in one of your rooms. And I just had for you a simple question about one of the toilets here. Yes, what is it? Okay, so in Germany, um, it's a bit embarrassing, but like in Germany, when you are done, you are go number two. And when you are done, a thing will come out from the toilet and will spray you clean with the wasser. And I just, I cannot seem to find that here. Yeah, unfortunately, we don't have any of those attached here to any of our rooms. Um, hmm. Okay, so, like, I'm not really sure what I'm going to do then, because, like, I'm, this is my first time in America, and I've never done the American way of doing things, and I understand it's, like, a very wild west out here, and so I'm, like, what I'm going to do now? I don't know, why do you have your reservation? Well, I, uh, mm, that's not going to help me for the vibe, is it? I mean, I see there are towels here, and I did have to use some towels for this earlier, and I had for them to put outside the door for someone to take, but it is not very convenient when I want to use my towels for the showering. But I'm seeing, like, there is a roll of the nose tissue paper in here, but... Um, I'm not seeing really anything for to make clean. There should be toilet paper in there. Um, I'm that, yeah, that, there is a paper here. I do see paper for the nose, like when you are when you are blowing your nose. Mhm. Mm okay. So, so you're currently in here. You say I'm gonna. Yeah, I'm I'm in my room now. Um, so Where I'm are you? I just I'm gonna use this paper. I'm, do you need to know my room number for a simple toilet Yes, question? I can send you some toilet paper, yeah. If, if, if you're well, saying you don't I'm, have any I mean, of your... I have, uh, no, I have the paper here. I just didn't know that that was what you are to do with it. I thought it was for the nose. Yeah, no, that's, that's toilet paper. <laughs> oh, okay, I'm sorry. That's just a crazy American Wild West way of doing things. That's why I came here for this kind of rustic camping like third world country kind of feeling to a vacation but i will use this paper now and i will try now to flush it down i think it is i think it's gonna go real good so let's uh let's see how, okay, how we're gonna do that else I can help you with? um i think well i think it's going down but uh, wait wait oh no um the this is sophia how can i help you Hey, Sophia, how's it doing? I'm doing well. How are you? This is uh, Jim Fat calling from Wayward Westward. How you doing? Oh. Oh. Hello? Yeah, you, get, you got any histograms up there? I'm, not, I, I'm sorry, I can't make out what you're saying. Oh, hey, this is Jim Fat with Wayward Westward. How you doing? I'm good. How can I help you? Yeah, Sophia, you got any histograms up there? Histogram? Yeah. Maybe a pie graph? Bar chart? No. Well, what do you have up there? What is this regarding? 
Oh, oh, okay. So this is Jim Fat with Wayward Westward. How you doing today? Well, I don't have a good idea, so it's fine. Turkey Uptown. For directions, touch one. You are being transferred to. You are being transferred to the operator. You are being transferred to. You are being transferred to. You are being transferred to the operator. Thank you. Hi, please have a gift on this sector. How may I assist you? Hey, what's up? This is Jim Fat. How are you going? I'm sorry. This is Jim Fat calling from Wayward Westburn. I can't hear you. I'm sorry. I'm on a lunch break. This is Jim Fat calling from Wayward Westward. How you doing today, sir? Good. How can I help you? I'm I'm calling to make sure your employees are washing their hands. You guys have an employees must wash yes. hands sign. Yes. And are you a manager up there? Yes, I'm a supervisor. Do you make sure your employees wash their hands? Do you do you supervise that? No, everybody that signs enough so they can they know when to wash their hands, and we also have time. To well, how do, how can you tell? How can how can you make sure? Because I need to check this off my clipboard. I got a piece of paper on a clipboard here. I got to check this off. Uh, so do you want to talk to my? I uh, can leave you send you to my GMA, G, uh, GM and he'll tell you. That's not gonna work. I'm calling from Wayward Westford. This is Jim Fat. I'm calling on my lunch break right now. You can appreciate that, right? I appreciate that, but at the same time, uh, you could talk to him because I'm not able to disclose any information like that. So you're not a supervisor there? I am, but I'm not allowed to give you that information out. So, so you're putting your supervisor duties uh, onto who? Who are, you, who are you passing this off to? My GM. My GM. Your GM. So you, you do not want to be a supervisor today. So you could just choose when you're a supervisor, or how does it work up there? I'm calling from Wayward Westward. Okay, is this going to go any further? I, like I said, I could transfer you over to there before you call. I'm do you handle any food when you don't wash your hands? Do you handle any food? I don't handle food right now, so I'm not. But, but your employees, when they don't wash their hands, do they handle any food? We always wash our hands, sir. But how can you tell? How, how do you know? That's, that's the question. Do you have some kind of clipboard that says, I wash my hands, or some kind of I, record I, that shows I, I, that? Sir. I'm sorry, sir. I'm not going to disclose this anymore. You have to have a record of this. This, 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 is, this is law. This is New Hampshire okay, law right so here, well, buddy. You can transfer over to my, well, I'm, talk to my GM. I'm you calling from way we're rushing. I don't want to be put on hold. I, I'm calling on my lunch break right now. This is serious business. Like, this is a health you, concern you can here. I can, I can be here. Well, I'm just saying I, I could get someone down there to come break. check this out. Health inspector or? Well, okay, I wash I'll my pass. hands, so. I'll pass you over to my GM's voice, though. So I, I mean, I'm, I'm not a concern here. So, you don't really have to comment on that. I'm not gonna say anymore. So, except like transfer me over to my set. Uh, well, I, I gotta check off this clipboard. Do you have any bar graphs there? Any, any histograms? A line graph, maybe? He turned his head away from the microphone, <laughs> so he could call. Looking to end in Sweet Midtown, this is Chantel speaking. How may I help you? Hello? Hi, this is uh, Looking to end in Sweet Midtown. Yeah, we got a situation up here in, in the hallway. Uh, some guy is spraying fire extinguishers everywhere. He said he works for uh, you. But I don't think he does. What, what so let for? Me, let me put you on the phone with him. Here. Buddy, dude, just take the phone and take, talk to the lady. Yeah, fine, just keep spraying it and, and talk to her. You're fucked up now, buddy. You're fucked up now. You're getting the fucking dust. Yeah, well, what are you going to do now? Hello? Hi, um, this is, this is the front desk. Is there, um, may I ask the name? Mm, I'm the extinguisher, bro. This is what I do. This is my job. This is my life and my livelihood. You know, I do this for every little boy and every little girl who ever had a dream. You got. You got She's currently making toilet gravy. All right. Make Dragomir do a call. Uh, Installing that new machine. Hello. 
Good evening. This is Morgan with Jury Hotels. How may I help you? Hi, Morgan. I heard you were doing... I thought you were a mistress of some sort. Maybe that was mistrust. Anyway, uh, do you have any room openings for tonight? Um, it looks like I do have a few rooms open. Okay, because we have the How fire many? extinguisher up here. And we're wondering if we can get some more rooms so we could maybe get the fire extinguishers out of the room. Let's spray it. Oh, my Lord. Uh, my kid's got a hold of one, so pull the pin on it, and I think it's out now. Ah. No. Uh, so can we, hmm. how many more rooms can we get so we can get more of these? They're out of date, it's cool. I don't know. Yeah. Um, well, it looks like I've got a room with two queen beds that's going for one fifty four ninety nine before tax for this evening. Okay, how many fire extinguishers come in the room? So one, oh. or two, like one in the bathroom, one in the, in, in the shower room, maybe. You know, unfortunately, that room doesn't come with any fire extinguishers. Now, where do we find the fire extinguishers? Here, let me put my kids on the phone. I'm going to go look out out there and take a look. All right. Hello, lady. Hello, lady. Hello, Hello son of the person I was speaking with. Hey, something's wrong with my dad. Yeah? Yeah. He's not uh, acting right. That's concerning. Huh? Well, that's concerning. Concern. He's spraying off fire yeah. extinguishers and shit. Um, does your dad have a mental health diagnosis that needs to be addressed? Because you can call um, 911 no. and they'll take a look no, at him. Do you have a mental health diagnosis that needs to be addressed? I don't, actually. Minecraft. Do you want to talk to my little brother? Um, uh, I mean, quite me frankly, I'm... On. Let me put him on. Hang on. Let me put him on. Hello? Hello? Uh, I'm looking to get Hero Brian in Minecraft. Um, I unfortunately don't handle anything with Minecraft. Um, I work with you guest know requests the and reservations. I don't. I'm I so sorry. I'm not very good at diamonds. Diamonds. I, I know it, dude. That's. I'm. I'm not sure if that's good or not. I'm not very good at Minecraft. What do I do? Um. So. I don't know. That's a great question. Um, that doesn't relate to my job duties as my, my a worker for Curry Hotel. So, um, that's that's good. That's great. He said he's going out for a smoke. Okay. Play Minecraft. I mean, I unfortunately am <laughs> not able to play Minecraft at this wow. time, sir. Should I pass Sunny. the phone or? Sunny. Look, I need to go get a box of Marlboros. I'll be back in about 15 years, okay? Alrighty, hello. well, I, hello, I don't plan on working here in 16 years, but it's been a pleasure speaking with you this evening. If you have any further questions oh, you about got your bigger stay. plans for the future. Did, did you hear that they put plans. Alpatine in Fortnite? Well, you I don't play Fortnite. Well, they put Palpatine in Fortnite to announce the new Star Wars movie. That's really cool. It was like, a, 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 it was look, like a cross look. promotion type thing. You talk about these things, and that's why girls don't come around the house. Oh my! Um, it. Do you, 
I have been pleased to serve you this evening, but my shift is they, coming they to an end, and I have other pressing matters. Nowadays. They, they got the Terminator in Minecraft? Or no, no, Steve, Fortnite. Steve, Fortnite. Steve, no, Steve, no, I'm Steve. thinking Fortnite, yeah. They, they got all the superheroes and stuff? That's wonderful. Look, you shouldn't be no, you shouldn't be thinking about these things. You should be thinking about girls. They have girls in Fortnite. Well, it's been a pleasure serving Real you, ones. but I've already had enough overtime this week, and my shift is at an end. So, um, I, unfortunately, I have to transfer you to my compatriot for further service. Have a wonderful rest of your evening. So hello. patriotic. Hello? 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 Oh no. Hello? Oh, so For some reason. River Mountain Lodge front desk, how may I help you? Hello? Hello? Can you hear me now? Can I help you? Yes. Hello, ich bin Johann. I'm staying in one of your rooms and I had just for you one question about the toilets. Yep. This is my first time in America and I'm not really sure of like the American way of doing things and so I'm not sure when it's a little embarrassing but like when you are at the toilets and you are done, you are, you are number two, and then there is like a thing in Germany that will come out and it will spray with the wasser, and I do not see this thing here. Yeah, unfortunately, we don't have a bidet. Hmm, well, okay, that is for me like a little bit of a problem because I'm not sure what exactly I'm going to do. Yeah, uh, if you're um, not likely to find that anywhere in, in America that I know of. I've never seen anywhere with one. Okay. Hmm. So, like, when I'm here, I'm sitting here, and I sit, and I think, like, okay, I, I have, have uh, like, there are towels, but I want to use them for the shower. Um, I could, but there is, like, also, like, for here, a nose paper, just a tissue for blowing the nose in a roll or something, and I, I see nothing really for which I can make with clean. Yeah, you might try going to, like, a grocery store, like City Market or something, and they have some uh, flushable wet wipes that might be best for you. That's a good idea, I guess. I did not know they had these things, but for me now, when I am here currently and I am, like, in the bathroom and I'm in this situation, what I'm going to do? Mm, yeah, I'm, I'm not sure, honestly. <laughs> Um, well, okay, so what I had to do for earlier was I had this problem, and it's not really the best way of solving the problem, and I'm German, we love the good way of solving the problems, but what I had to do was a bad way to solve the problem, but it is very urgent, so I had to take towel and wipe myself down there, and so when I do for this, I put it outside the door for like when you're going to get your shoes shined or something like that, I put it out for someone to take care of, but it is not good way of doing Things. I'm not sure what I'm going to do. Mm, yeah, I would just recommend going to the grocery store and getting some uh, flushable wipes. Well, I'm sitting on the toilet now. Is, is there some way that like, maybe you can like come bring me some or something or maybe show me what it's doing? Like, I'm not sure like what I'm going to do. Uh, unfortunately, I don't have any, um, but yeah, I would just... Uh, so, well, like Americans do something when they're in the toilet, yeah? Like you have, a, like you only in America, like have these wet wipes are the only things that you can do. I got nothing else out here to keep me clean, but like a towel or something. There's like nose paper, but that's not going to work on your anus. Yeah, unfortunately. Which spread uh, me. Yeah, I'm I'm honestly not really sure. I would just recommend going to the store whenever you can to get some of those uh, flushable wet wipes. Okay, so for like maybe is there someone out in the hallway or something that will maybe help me? I will knock on one of these doors and maybe a nice neighbor will help me to wipe or find what is wiping or something, do you think? Probably not. We fine. I think I think we have nice neighbors. It's not to be a problem. 
Hallo, Sir. Hallo. Ja, yeah, I, I wonder, I'm sorry, I'm just in my first time in America from Germany. Um, I wonder, can you are showing me what is doing with the toilets, sir? Here, here, come here. I'll, I'll help you, good sir. Come here, come here. All right. Oh, thank you. All right, all right, bend, all right. bend at the waist, bend straight over. Okay, okay. I go down. Then okay, oh, no, like grab, your, uh, yeah, yeah, down. No, grab your, grab your, grab one on each cheek and then open. Okay, I spread, I spread. Okay, here, let me get a, let me get a nice big you know, little handful here. And do you, do you prefer to go uh, top to bottom or bottom to top? Well, normally I don't actually use this. This is my first time using these crazy uh, American contraptions because in Germany we have like the R spritzer that will spray your anus with water, will spray oh, you clean. Oh. It's like a magic. Okay, well, here, I got the three seashells. Let me help you here. Let me see. All right, we got it spread. Okay. Well, how do we use these three seashells? This is crazy. Well, I see. I press. I press the two together and it separates, and then you just scrape with the other one. Oh, my God. But that is true. What is with the third with the seashell? Yeah. Well, it, you don't use water to wash it off afterwards. You have you have to lick it. Oh, they, oh well, delete this. Mm. And this is the American way I will do it. Yeah, it's quite cleansing. It's, uh, it's better than rubbing, rubbing shit back into your asshole with paper. So interesting. I'm feeling it is very friction. It is very like not as soft as you would want on your anus, but it is nice to having like the help of like a kind stranger. Well, we, we do have pine cones as well because of the ridges on those. They are, they're quite good at collecting the fecal matter. Oh, my God. Also, when we are I done here with the wiping and really things. Well. Hello, what? Uh, yeah, can you, hello on the phone? You. <laughs> no, we don't need that. The man is already here. He is quickly almost done with wiping my anus and he leaves the toilet paper next to the towels for you to clean up for us. But I'm thinking like now we're going to have like I'm so happy that this man has cleaned my anus that, like, I feel maybe I'm going to show you Americans how as crazy Germans do our discotheque parties. And so I'm going to mm. put a sock on my door handle and I'm going to fucking knock on these other doors and find other cool, fun, crazy American strangers in the wild west of America who are going to come out and party with me. And I want you to come up to my room on the second floor. You will know it by the poopy towels. And you come, you party with us, and we have so much fun. That sounds like a great time. Party. Hello, party over here. Party in my room. Hello, party. Yes, we're partying here. Yes, you'd come too. Welcome, yes. Hello, we are party. Do not worry, I have no pants. Come party. Are you, you come to my room now, bitte? Just uh, let everyone know that if they have to go to the bathroom, they can have help wiping when they're done. Oh, yeah. I mean, this is this is the whole environment that we have set up here for. We have a very welcoming thing. I have a very new friend here. He wants to say hello to you and tell you more about, about the wiping. Hello, Dwight. You said his name was Dwight. He wants to tell you about yeah, what I, we have done. I, we, we brought, we brought, we brought we, so like, we got machines in this room. To not laugh that whole time. You're not the only one. <laughs> it is I very ticklish when a man is wiping your anus. <laughs> and we appreciate you, all of the people here in the crazy hallway who are partying in the discotheque. We have Big Stupid Axe partying. We have Brian in. We have Cat Astrophe. We have Crispy and Dragon Mirror and Dwight. That was Cat. That was Cat. That was Cat there. Yeah, that's what Cat saying hello to you. We have Gordo, we have Loxapol here. We have so many people in the holiday. We have Milkman, and he is from a radio station from 98.6, The Mouth. And we have Mr. Clay, and Turbo, and Turbo, and the Wasted Machines, and Wasted Phone, and Zenorax. And you are here, invited to a party. You come, you go to immortaljuice.com, and you see us, we have a party for you. What, what was the website? Immoral Juice. Dot com. And there can you go, you hear that we are partying, for we live stream the party all night in your hotel, and we tell everyone that you gave us permission for this, yes? Yes. 
And your name, Faz? This is Megan. Okay, thank you, Megan. I will call back. I will tell your manager that we are here, we are party, and you come to the second floor and we are discotheque, a crazy American Wild West parties, yeah? Sounds good. And just before we go, can we get like as many people as we can possibly in this party to like say hello before we go so that everyone can be like, hello, come to our party. It is crazy American style. You know, honestly, the second floor sounds pretty cool. You might be able to just go knock on everyone's door and have them come over. They're all worshiping me. Want to hello? We have Sid. Crystal Math? Oh. It's not a party until Satan shows up. Get in close for the picture, guys. Get in, take a big picture, and oh, everybody talk so cool. on the phone to this lady. You're all invited to the after party in hell. This is great. Jesus oh, Christ, do they have any chips and, chips and mm-hmm. fucking dips over here? Did you ask if we have chips? Yes, chips and dips. Is, this is, this is. Chips, no dips. <laughs> chips, Get no dips. Get ranch. Get spicy ranch. I put my hands and my hands upon your hips, and when you dip, I dip, we dip. <laughs> what, what, what kind of car do you drive? Where do you live? Does it go fast? Oh my goodness! Can you drive me to my uh, uh, job appointment? Here's this person. When you are done with that, then maybe like we will get married, and I will get American green card. I have offered that before. Oh, really? I have your son's What? You driving to my job? I, I got a uh, job appointment tomorrow. Where at? In the big office. Can you drive me there? <laughs> um, it depends if I'm awake or not. I might just sleep all what day. What kind of shoes are you? Hey, hey. What kind they of shoes are you? Keep up all night. There we go. What? Yeah. What, what size shoes are you? <laughs> Ask him the important do questions, you, I see. Do you, don't don't do you answer have, him. He has a shoe fetish. Don't answer him. Do you have him. any socks on right now? <laughs> oh, Jesus you, Christ. Here he goes again, guys. What the fuck is he going doing? commando. No, now he's done it. Don't tell him you wear sandals because he thinks sandals are like the thongs of the feet. No sandals. Oh, shoe, I bet in. your left shoe is untied right now. Please tell me your left shoe is untied. No, oh, God. Don't do it. <laughs> I mean, if I, I mean, a oh, foot dad, fetish don't isn't don't. really that crazy when you're from Germany. There are the people who will like the cock above you on that glass table so that for you can watch for the poop to come down. A foot really isn't that big a deal. Hmm. <laughs> I gotta oh ask. Oh my god, I bet you have some. Uh, have some what? You have some white bands on, don't you? Mm. Mm, no. But mm. I'm wearing New Balance. I'm wearing New Balance over here. I like New Balance. I'll, I'll keep it a secret for now. Are you, Are you gonna join our party on Xbox Live? Xbox Live. I don't have a TV for my Xbox. Xbox Live. <laughs> you can add me on the Xbox. It is Big Boy Farts 666. It is crazy. Big Boy Farts 666. Let me write that down. Yes, and then we are gaming, we are playing, we are live chats. You will show me your things on live stream. And then we will be best friends, we will get married, I will get an American green card, and then it is all good. That sounds like a great plan. Very, very realistic. You are making your oh, husband very that. happy right now. I think you should come to our party. <laughs> you come up, you knock it's on pretty, the door. Pretty tempting. <laughs> no, stop worrying. I need to go to bed. Stop it. You are calm. Everyone is in the room. All the people in the room, they are taking their clothes off, and we are going to have a big, crazy time. 
Wow. That sounds I will show you how American gangbangs work. <laughs> hey, you need to get out of here. You shouldn't be here right now. Where do I put my thong? Okay, now everyone is going to line up and they're going to take their shirts off first. Is it going to be on the live stream? Oh, yeah, it all will be on the live stream. We are streaming it live on immorejewish.com. And you will come, you will watch, you will see. And Johan will get wiped again. (laughs) You're eating a Philly cheesesteak in between 10 naked people? No, but I'm also new to experience. Can I have a bite of the the, the steak, steak sandwich? Okay, and then, well, will your pants are down like this, you will bend over and spread, and for Johan will come down the line and will giving you all nice, happy licks. Oh my gosh. Since we don't uh, have bidets. And then. I think Johan is going to be the bidet, but I'm not sure. <laughs> I clean you good, and you will, like, come and for use me for your urinal. I think it's like a manual German operation we got going on up it's here. It's a hotel room. We do not even need to be clean. We can trash this motherfucker and just get crazy <laughs> German I style. I be up here right now. And it'll only cost you $200. It's not going to cost Small me anything. I don't have a fucking green card yet, baby. Mm-hmm. Yes. I'm what you Americans would call a um, vagrant. I have come to meet man from internet here, but I have been stood up, but luckily have found nice people here to make party in America. It is a very good place. Hey, but you're going you're gonna to have to clean up this window. Spread it, yeah. Spread it on the window. And then will I get out my my riding crop and then I will show you how American dominate goes. I will bring out my leather and the straps and the buckles and I will show you how we party down with leather and latex in Germany. Hey, you can't you can't spray that around here. What are you doing? My God, who has who has got the extinguisher? Oh my God, I can't breathe. <laughs> what happened? Why? I'm what I'm stopping. gonna do now? God, I'm trying to sleep. Why do you guys keep bothering me? No, Ted. No, you're it. Ted, you're it. Shut up, stupid American. Ted. You're it. You don't belong in this country. I'm gonna break the fucking window. Stop. Yeah, Actually, it's not really that bad. Yeah, you don't get a do hit this shit. God damn it! That was the other window. Anyway, I'm gonna like we got this lady down here, and I have cleaned her anus, and I'm going to like fucking go to town, and we're just gonna listen, baby. This is what her anus sounds like. <laughs> Who are you people? Leave me alone. Are you not gonna come and join me, pal? Hey, rub solution on its skin. No, I'm here. <laughs> Well, it was a really good party, guys. I guess we will um, pack it up and I will... um, We are going and we are driving away now. Bye. I'm leaving you all. You will be without the dominatrix now. Oh, shit, shit, shit. (laughs) Nine, nine, nine. (laughs) Oh. (laughs) <laughs> Are you taking me on? customers right now? 
Uh-huh. Night, he, Kaka. He, he Are you going to go to the site, though? This is, this is actually what? Brad Carter calling from the corporate office. Could you put a customer on? Um, there. Oh, my gosh. You're here already? Oh, I guess it's 935. Oh. Yeah, I'm here, and everyone's being really loud. I'm trying to sleep, and they keep breaking windows. Baby Jesus, help us. Excuse you? Oh, my good God. (laughs) Hello? Can you hear me? You're a filthy woman. You know that? You would not believe what just happened. Yes, I am. You poopied on the phone. <laughs> like, what's the dollar amount? I want to know the dollar amount. Like, how I don't know. How, I want to know how long this call is. I want to know the dollar amount that corporate dollars have been wasted. This has all been a test. It's a sham. It's a this hoax. Byron. <laughs> hey, Byron, how's it going? I'm in one of your rooms, and I have a question for you, buddy. Who cares? Oh, well, I'm going to report you to the Better Business Bureau. I'm going to call your manager. I'm going to come in there with my mom, whose name is Karen, and she will Why? tell Why? you what does that what concern you? Why does that concern you? Man, talk to this guy, please. Please. This guy seems concerned. You know, yeah, yeah. Why are you concerned? Long? I'm concerned because this lady is not doing her job. Who cares? She's... She's messing around on the phone instead of working. I can't hang up on you. Are you still talking? Get out of my room, guys. I don't want you guys here. I gotta go to bed. Is there a mm-hmm. point to this? Not really, Not sure. but has that ever mattered before? <laughs> yeah, why? Tell me why. Who are we talking to? Why are you concerned? concerned? Why are you concerned? Yeah. Why are you concerned? I'm concerned because everyone keeps seeing mm-hmm. stuff in my hotel room. I'm trying to go back. <laughs> I said, why are you concerned? Spoil spot. Ma'am, oh, my honey, honey, German baby. friend here is very upset with your hotel because there are no bidets. Um, I would just keep uh, asking that friendly neighbor to help him out. I think it all comes <laughs> back to shit. I'm pretty sure it is where all of this is leading to. It all comes back to we're we're all human and, you know, and sometimes waste, it kind of just has to come. And, and you know, because we have to feed on stuff to get energy. And that's just really where it comes down to. You get what I'm saying? Speak <laughs> for yourself, motherfucker. I'm not human. No, I don't know what you're talking about. Get out of my goddamn room. Hello? Ma'am? No. Hello? Get out of my room, Dad. Grandma? Oh, God, how should get here? Hello? Oh! Oh, God. Yeah, Why are you singing for me? This is crazy. Hello? No, it's not Saturday. Not... Oh, who the hell is this? It's not Sunday. How no, it is, and you've missed church. Ha, 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 ha. So that's a blessing. Is it? Yeah. yeah I guess you, you didn't have to put money inside the little basket. So, yeah. no. It, it, here I was rushing. Well, I, I... Yeah, we're not in trouble. I don't know. God is a vengeful God, at least in the Old Testament. <laughs> The old yeah, can you speak a little louder, please? Why? <laughs> oh, wait, wait, what are you doing with that fire extinguisher? 
Uh, spray grandma with the fire extinguisher. She needs a full oh, off. I am your daddy. Ma'am? Uh huh, uh huh. No. Uh. Asshole. We're all brothers, we're all sisters. That's what some other guys Vapor. I haven't reach, reached uh, full capacity with potency yet. Uh, Vapor. Uh, well, you know. I feel like you're not even paying attention to us, ma'am. Come on, you got to give it your time to, of day. I have to tell you Hi, something. Bye, Are you there? I'm touching myself. <laughs> yes. Okay, so this guy... This guy came into town. He said, I'm new in town. Where's the grocery store at? And I was like, I'm sorry. We don't end our sentences with prepositions here. And he said, oh, okay. I'm so sorry. Where's the grocery store at, asshole? (laughs) Asshole. I want you to stick me in your dick like a fidget spinner. Okay. You all have a dick? Oh, didn't know that. Did you go to immoraljuice.com on your browser, on your work computer, or no? <laughs> Maybe. Gladly and cream corn. And, I want to know um, that you are going to immoraljuice.com every Friday and are going ah, on your work no. computer. No! Uh, no! Yeah. No! Yeah, yeah, yeah. No! No! That yes. sounds dangerous. No! This no, could be you no, one day. No, 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 no! You've no, been on the phone no, so no. long, you may as well just be one of us. Come, join the dark side. <laughs> you got a knack for it. I'm Come on in. I'm very confused. This is such a scam. The party on me all the time. floor two is fun. But in my in. butt. Megan? <laughs> What? Megan Schroeder? This, this, make, this all makes I'm sense. You, this, this, you're okay. <laughs> Thank you. It, this isn't a dream. It, this is all happening. This is, this is real. This is actually happening right now. Me. We actually have a so confession sure. to make. Um, this has all just been an elaborate hoax, a prank by a... Very cool radio station. Check it out. We're from 98.9 The Weenus. 98.9 The Weenus. The wacky oh my God. radio show in town. Condone first degree murder. Advocate cannibalism. This guy's You're guy. live on the radio. What do you want to tell the people? I, I just don't know what's real anymore. How can <laughs> mirrors be real? If our eyes aren't real, and that is from the philosopher Jaden Smith, and so you can take that to the bank, ma'am. You know, I, I will well, make sure to in use the that. And shut the fuck up. It's my manager, so no. That guy broke my window. Oh, put her on we'll, the phone. Yeah, put her on the phone. Yeah. Put her on the phone. Um, Hello there. Are you we, stroking we, it? We just want to talk like business stuff. Just like official business Hi. stuff. I, you know, I don't think it will look good if I've been on the phone for 27 minutes. Yeah, well, give it to her, and I'll, so get, I'll, get, I'll get you a raise. Don't you worry about it. <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm going to have to deny the offer. I'm so sorry. Okay, well, I'll get your manager to break some windows. She'll get fired, and then you'll get promoted. Come on, let's do this. Stop breaking my windows. I need... yeah. and then we're going to get married, well, and I'm going to have, like, American green card. How, how, yeah, how, to get to the top. Uh, yeah, to get to the top of the corporate know. ladder, you're gonna have to step on some heads on the way up. I'm gonna make starting with her. W three o six. All right, I'll let the house person know and they'll bring them up to you. All right. The house person. <laughs> uh, Who's no. the house hey, person? Put the cat back on the Put the cat back on the right. yeah. I know it does. I didn't I, just I call. Sure is it going to be a problem? Person is responsible for their house music, not <laughs> other things. 
um, towels. Well, answer the question. Does does the person, the house person, do they play house music? Is that their um, role? This house person, no, but some of them might. Uh, so so no the musical preferences of the house person. <laughs> Did I get a refund on my room? Uh, 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 uh. Possibly. So you think their association mm-hmm. with it, towels it prohibits them from enjoying house music? Is that what you're saying? Basically. Wow. We are needing house very music bold for the party. I'm so sorry. I did not catch that. Hey, I want to check if a guest is there. Uh, it's actually two people. Um, their names are Julian and Jumpin Perez. Hmm. Julian Jumpin Perez. Yeah. I got a. I got another mm-hmm. last name. It's Perez. Julian Jumpin Perez. Oh yeah. Mm. And I'm looking. I'm looking for a womb. No and so, when you're done with that, then maybe you will tell me I'm looking for a nice warm womb for the night. Got any closed shackle padlocks up there? Unfortunately, we're sold out. But you might be able to climb up. Climb up in that womb. Oh, nein, the man is playing his organ. He's playing with his fucking organs. This is nasty. Quit calling me. Hello? You stole a dog. Sorry? This is Jakey Brickner, your boutique hotel. I just missed a call. That's like stealing somebody's child. What? Why are you calling me? Because I just had a missed call from this number. That's irrelevant. Hello. Hi, how are you? All right. Uh, Hey, hey, listen. Hey, hey, much mouth. I can already hear you. You don't have to keep repeating yourself. Uh, I've got an issue. Hello? Yeah, hi. Yeah, how can I help you, sir? Uh, what what is the fee if I'm caught smoking in this room? I'm just trying to weigh my options. Oh, um, I should be. Are you in a non-smoking room? Yeah, I I actually requested a non-smoking room so that I could smoke in it. I'm kind of a dick like that. Okay, no, you cannot smoke in the room, sir. Well, no, I, I'm going to. I'm just trying to find out what the repercussions are. Well, we'll be fine about a hundred dollars for that. Ah, oh, that ain't shit. I, I've got some of the finest sticky. Like, I'm going to roll up a fat J and I'm going to smoke a joint. Okay. Well, um, then we'll charge you for, for that. That's all. No, and then when I'm done, and then when I'm, done I'm going to put it out. I'm going to put it out on the wall. Okay. What room are you in, sir? Uh, that's none of your business there, honey baby. Well, you, if you're in my hotel, it's my business. No, I don't. I don't really think it is. And where do you get off talking to me like that? Who lit the fuse on your tampon? Cobblestone in. This is Lorraine. How can I help you? Hello, Lorraine. Hello. Yes. Hello. Yeah. You know about business. You know. You you know business. You can do business. No, I do not. Like a bees nest, like with bees. Oh yes, I do know. Yes. Yeah, like you know what those look like, right? Like how it's got like all that paper and stuff, and it's like a little ball kind of thing, like a, like the like honeycomb. Cylinder. Yes. Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I I got a spider nest up here. What are we What are we gonna do about that? It's hanging up here. Like a spider web? I'll I can bring up like a Swiffer. No, 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 no. no. This is a spider nest, like a bee's nest. Yeah. I come up and kill it. Well, I mean, a couple minutes ago they got angry and and the spiders started coming out. They were trying to sting me. 
Like, how big is it? How big is the nest about? Like, if I brought up gloves... It's just as big as a bumblebee nest. It's like a paper bumblebee nest. What room are you in? It's it's a spider nest. I believe you. What what, what should I do for the time being? Well, I'm going to try to get you into somebody else. Let's see if I can get you in a different room. Like apple cider vinegar and a spray bottle or... Like window cleaner? No. What do I shoot at this thing? Hey, I, I, hey man, I'm trying to get him with this fire extinguisher. Oh, my, my it's buddy, you need a fire off. extinguisher. What, it's it's you need the the are you serious? What room are you in? Oh, they're what mad. Oh, I, I mean, I, I'm a guest of my buddy. He's using the fire extinguisher right now. What room are you in, sir? Uh, this, this, this is not deterring them I mean, at I, all. You're going to have to wait a second. He's trying to take out the, this spider nest here. Well, you should, I, it's not a good idea to be doing that. What room are you in, sir? No, no, I think I think he's taking care of them. It looks like they're dying off. Okay. They're starting to it die off. It sounds like he's getting them. It really sounds like he's getting them. Oh, I think but, I just see the uh, what, what's the what's the what's the room fee like if you like break uh, like a window? I'm gonna or, put you in a different room if you tell me what room you're in. I need to know so I can send me. Yeah, what, what's there. that fee though? Ooh, what? Yeah, I can tell you that. What's that fee though? Ooh, what's that fee? A uh, refund, maybe? A, a I'm refund? Sure. I'm not sure. So I need to call my boss. What room are you in, sir? I need money. to know what room are you well, in. What, what kind this of... This is the auditor. Kind of, who are you? I am Lorene, and hey, I need to know what room... Are you a guest hey, at this hotel, sir? Are you a manager sir? there? G- give me the, give me the no, phone real sir. quick, ma'am. You're going to give me a refund what? when ma'am. I broke a window? What kind of sick joke is this? What the fuck are you sir. talking about, Maureen? Ma'am, look, listen to how angry these, these, these spider bees are. They're making noise. <laughs> Reen, uh, I don't want to be presump- pre- presumptuous, but do you know where that sound comes from? Reen? Latrine? Latrine? Hang on, let's get these spiders. The German Wolfskin. Hi, sir. I'm calling dispatch so I can have him come out and help you. Um, please let me know what room you're in. I need to know. Hello? Hello? There are bees, uh, are spiders. Yes, I I, there are spiders on their everywhere. Way. Dispatch is on their way. Police is. Please tell me what room you're in, sir. I need to know. The, well, I am, tell me I'm what room you're in, sir. Please tell me what room. I have five rooms. I can send them to each one. Please please Oh my god, there is a man doing the fireworks outside my door and all the spiders have come into my room. Do you understand? What room are you in? I'm not going to call the police on spiders. I I have called the police. They're on their way. I need to know what room you're in now, sir. Please call the police on fucking spiders? Please let me know what room you're in. The police are on their way right now. I think you're lying. You're not... That can't be right. You're not calling the police on spiders. I am. You're using fire extinguisher. You've used foul language to me. I've... That's not... I've never done that. This is my first time calling you. There are the men from the other room is fucking with these spiders. The spiders went through my door. It went under the door. Tell the police to go to your room and help you. Why did you do that? They're just spiders. Did you even you're check? Did you really even confirm anything was happening, you though? Too much noise. You need to stop no, you actually are wasting emergency in. services because you didn't conf- up there. Please let me know so I can tell dispatch what room you're in. You never confirmed anything was even happening, and so you have already sir. called the... You're wasting yes, emergency you services, have. and that is not cool. Absolutely not. You're emergency. You use our fire No, you are... To come up but to what if you are hearing like a room. crazy I sound? I out of your room and you did not. You took it upon yourself, not your other caller, to use the fire extinguisher the in the room. Tell me what room Never. you're in so I can tell dispatch. Well. They are on their way. If I have to go to all ten rooms, I will have them. Marin, uh, you did not call dispatch. The wackiest radio show Let's be serious here, Marin, okay? Okay. Oh, so I had to do so. She was Thank you for calling Best Western Plus, Stevens County, and located in Hickinson, Kansas. My name is Teresa. How may I help you? 
Teresa? Teresa? Yeah. Wait, Wasted's going to make this call. Can I just transfer you to him real quick? Who? Wasted memory. Can I just uh, transfer you to him real quick? It, it'd make a lot more sense if I just transfer you. Okay. One second. Uh, hello, 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 hello. Hi. Hi, how are you? Okay, how are you? Okay, um, not not well. They um, the, the, we have a spider problem right now. No, we don't. No, I am. I'm having one, like right now. What do you mean? No, you're no, you're not. What room number are you in? Why? Isn't that like a confidentiality thing here? What, like, what's the problem? Well, if we can fix your problem, then we would know what room you're in. Well, I wasn't. I didn't even think they would actually call. I mean, we dropped them, and I'm trying to clean them up, and now we got spiders all over the place. Hello, ma'am. We we uh, it's, it, we dropped drop. Hello. Thank you for calling Best Western Plus. This is Janae. How may I help you? It's Hello? black and it's got a red dot on it, and I don't know what to do. A what? It's a, it's huge and it's hairy and it's a spider in the corner of the room and it's black and it's got like the red dot on it, dude. What do I do? What room are you in? Oh my God, there's more, there's more. Oh God, it's like hatching eggs. Oh my God, there's like a thousand of them. What's going on? Hello? No, I'm not doing this. I'm getting out of this room, dude. I'm, this is crazy. This is crazy. Hey man, what? you, oh my God, watch out for this. Oh my God, they're following me. Dude, guy, guy, watch out down there. Hello? There's spiders coming out of my room and they're going to the hall. Ah! They're black and they have the red widow's widow's thing on it, dude. Are you saying it's the size of my go? palm? Are you? Yeah, uh, yeah. Okay, what room are you in? I'm probably not after the spiders. Okay, but what room are you in so I can send a housekeeper up there? I'm not in. I'm run, I'm. I went down the hall, dude. I'm like warning people that are going down, to, like get out of the way. They're literally like marching out of my room at this point. It's like they're after me. Are you okay? I I think so. There's this guy here. He looks he looks really strong. Um, he's kind of stomping him away. I think I think he's gonna do something. But I mean I mean there's too many. They might overwhelm him. Oh God, they're going up his leg. George oh God, they're up to his thighs now. Oh man, oh God, oh God, they're going in his pants. Oh, they're up his torso, oh fuck. Hello? This is like something out of The Hobbit. The what? The, you know, like, you know the big spider you ever, like, and when you were in, like, I don't know, sorry, it was like some, it was like a movie I saw, I'm sorry, there was like, there's spiders that are like coming out of my room. People are coming out of their rooms. They're stomping them, I'm sorry, and like it's going crazy. I'm, I'm my Patrick Cass. I'm staying in one of your rooms. Like spiders chase me out okay, of my so room. I'm in like what, near the stairs what room now. Are you in? I'm not in a room now. I'm I'm out in, near the stairs because these spiders. There's like literally like people that were walking down the halls like are overcome with spiders. It's like we're inundated with spiders. Well, I can, I mean, what I can do is I can call the ambulance, but that's all I can do. Well, they don't think that they're going to do anything about the spiders. Um, well, that's the only thing I can really do to. Hang on. There's another guy here. He seems to know really what's going on. He's, he's kind of helped some of the others. Like he, he stomped a bunch of the spiders and he stopped them all from him. And he pulled this like, spray thing out from behind and he sprayed off a he helped a few other people talk to him he looks like a kind of like a renegade like he knows what he's doing talk to him okay well um hi i'm bad news i'm a renegade okay so i don't have time for this i'm sorry but if you have a serious problem we can call 911 other than that i can't do i have this. a serious mental problem I know, so do I, and I have before, and so I get it. I'm not trying to say that I don't understand. That's why I said I can call the ambulance. Uh, or no, they can't do anything for me. I can call somebody from Compass. I Compass? Mean, yeah. Out of the way, out of the way. 
mental health facility. I got the gurney. Don't worry. And they yeah, have get them up on get up up on it. Um, for the ointment. Can they do a brain transplant? Because I'm got very a scared all the time. But anyway, so I need yeah, a brain the 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 get them up on the gurney. I have to get off the phone. This line needs to be clear. If there's an emergency... All anti-spider oh, yeah, units but... respond. We have a spider issue. Get it up to oh. the second floor. The hotel uh, is useless, guys. We got this. I'll yeah, go flush up them down. there, Thank but... Thanks, Andy. Okay, well, I gotta we go... Got yeah, we got a situation. We got everybody who was dealing with spiders on gurneys okay. now. We've got the spiders Is it okay, dude. though? I mean, is if you can't okay tone it down, we don't. can also call the police. I don't know which you want I got to do. the eight-legged... Because I really can't. I got the okay. eight-legged okay. handcuffs on these spiders. Don't worry. And is it we're okay? just a I'm up, here with a female, like a... I'm up here with a female employee, and I'm the only other employee here in a female. And I'm pregnant, and I'm not going to deal with the dangerous situation. You sound like a dangerous situation. So if you can't find a way yeah. to make this well, hallucination go away, I can call my boss, or I can call the police. Or you can just go to bed. I'm a I don't pregnant know which. man, and I'm here to say okay. I feel you, sister. As a pregnant... Thank you for calling the National Nine team of Garden City, Kansas. Junior, that's what you it was. Guest room number, please. Sister. Nunu says it's sister. Oh, lovely sister. Mr. Sister. It is the lowest rated Arnold Schwarzenegger film, where the one called Junior, where he gets pregnant. Thank you for calling National Line. That was a good movie, though. Hello? 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 Let me put my brother on. We have to find Mr. Sister. Hello? Twisted Sister. It's of the executive Water part of the brain, Susie and Q. I don't really... Hello? Suzy Q? That's... Hi, Suzy Q. This is Jack. Hello. Jack, Jack do you... Yeah, what's up? Okay, Jack what's Meehofer, up? I'm in room 215. Uh, you got the wrong number. I don't have no 215. Oh, Susie Q. Bye. Baby, I love you. Wait, 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 wait. I got a problem. Warner Hotel, this is Susie Q. <sighs> Susie Q, baby, I, I love you. Tell, listen, tell me true, baby. Susie Q. Excuse you? I'm sorry. I'm Listen, I'm sorry. I'm just calling because I got a secret crush, and I want you to turn a little to the left so I can get a better look at you, baby. Well, honey, I ain't even there, so you're looking at somebody totally different. How about that? Well, sweetheart, listen, what are you talking about you're not there when I'm looking straight at you? You're smoking crack. You need to get out that shit. Pumpkin, I'm not smoking crack, I'm smoking meth. So maybe first get it right and realize that I'm looking through the window and I'm seeing you and I'm saying turn to the left so I can get a good fucking well, honey, look at your uh, Susan Q, baby I love you face. Well, yeah, look I'm at me. Does it not have a window? Does it not have a window? Yeah, but like you don't even know where I'm driving. Where am I driving at? Where am I at right now? You're probably on. driving on the road, and there are probably some headlights behind you, and those are probably not me, because that'd be creepy. <laughs> yeah, you're being a little creepy. Who the fuck is this? My name is Patrick Katz, and I wanted to tell you, meow, do you do? And I'm, I'm, I was actually hired off of the website Fiverr to give you a message, because there's a man who has a crush on I, you. I have the message. May I dispense it? Yes, thank you. I've got I've got sure. the uh, the uh, telegram here. Okay, I thank have to open the it. briefcase. We have to we have to turn both keys at the same time. Yeah, and we got to notarize okay, it. It's open. Okay, it's open. We got the, my the message. The message reads: Susie Q at the Cheat Motel. She's no fool. Finds the cleanest room despite the cesspool. From the neon sign flicker. To the bed bugs track, Suzy Q's the champ of the dirty motel. That's a fact. Oh, Suzy Q. Baby, this guy loves you. Don't you want to know his name? Yes, I do. Who is it? I've had it on good authority that his name is Phil Harmonica. 
Oh, you're smoking no, crack it off. My name. Little Sanity Podcast, so funny. Good evening. Thank you for calling the Marriott Town Police Suites and Dodges. Danielle, how may I help you? Do you have to talk like that? We have to answer the phone like, like that. Is that is, no, I'm saying, like, is that your normal speaking voice? Well, yes, it is. Thank you. Could it be a little more pleasant? But it's not pleasant. And it's kind of shrill. Oh, I'm so sorry. What can I do for you today? Just just, just, just be yourself. Just be yourself. That's all I'm saying. I am. I am. Um, I'm just asking. So, okay. Okay, good. As long as, you, as long as you're happy, I'm happy. We're, we're all good. Um, so the leg on the table in here uh, seems to have broken. Okay. Which room are you in? Uh, 215. 215? Okay. Um, yeah. Yeah, what's going on, bud? Uh, I broke the leg. Okay. What, you just, you, you just set it back up? Uh, it, you, what, you just put it back under there like, like what, notice? Well, I tripped and fell onto the table and the leg broke off, so I put it back with some bubble gum. Wait a minute, how did you trip and, trip and fall? You're in a wheelchair. I was, I was inspired by something I saw on TV, and I stood up miraculously oh, and then fell. Were you doing your sick tricks again? Yeah, they call me Crazy Legs. Oh, yeah. That's my yeah, turn. I the legs and set up a rent. Yeah, Hello. Hi. Um, I just want to let you know you're going to have to put a charge on my room. Um, my friend here, we've been watching a lot of Tony Hawk videos and stuff. He's in a wheelchair, and I want to make him feel like more of the team. So we we broke two legs off of the off of the table and made a ramp, and uh, we're we're in here doing sick tricks. Oh yes. What room? He's, he's getting on full. He's going to do a full speed on his wheelchair, and he's hit, he's hitting at like five miles an hour, which is good for him. And like he's getting some serious air, bro. He got like a foot and a half last time. Oh really? Yeah, I'm um, I'm a handyman, but I also like to do sick tricks, and they, so they call me Tony Cock. You know, like cock in the shower. Yeah, he's basically the Stephen Hawking of the skateboard world, but with a wheelchair. Oh yeah. Yeah. That's pretty cool. Yeah, you're going too fast this hang on, he's going too fast this time. Fuck God damn it. Oh, that's gonna be another charge. Oh Don't worry about it. I've got this new credit card. Wait, wait okay. is that my credit card? Yeah, I found it in your wallet. That was in my pant you didn't find it. That was in my pants. I found it in your pants in your wallet. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Sir, do you have a, a, a long wooded object or possibly metal, like a mop handle? I would like, I, I, I got to disable his wheelchair. I don't. I don't yeah, know. I got to stick something through the spokes of these wheels. I'm going to slow him down a little bit. No, I don't. Why don't you? Do you can't do it. I opted for the bulletproof titanium wheels. Oh. Why, why don't you have a mop or something? Is it up your ass? Do you have a shoestring? Um, a shoestring? What is that going to do? Tie it. You can tie the wheels. I'm going to tie your wheels. I'm going to tie them. He's a bad so man. Good. He's telling you to put a stick in my wheel so that I flip over. Oh, you'll flip you over. You beat up kids, and you beat up kids in school, didn't you? No, I didn't. Listen, listen. Between me and you, like, if you write up one of these charges, or you want to pay a five dollar admission fee, I'll let you come up here and beat up a man in a wheelchair. What room is it? Let you relive the good old. Let you relive the good old days. Two fifteen. Two fifteen. Yeah. Don't send him up here. He's gonna That's beat you. He's gonna beat you mercilessly. They didn't give you a handicap room. No, I made him. I made him crawl up the steps with his chair. I'm handicapable. 
Poor guy. He just kept yelling the whole time, I can do it myself. He just kept yelling that the whole time. Why did you do it? Yeah. Why? Why indeed? Man, Sir, your feel... phone has a lot of Man. noise on it for some reason. It has noise. Can you hear me? Yeah, your phone. Yeah, phone's the set. quality there's of no one, your line no is, is bad. There's no one in two Did you say phone sex? No. Did you say phone sex? He did. I, I just him. said it's phone sex. There's nobody in room 215. What are you, it, what you talking about? Does that come with the room? The phone sex? No. He's trying to force phone sex on us, and I don't like it. Yeah, he's trying to, like, be subliminal about it. He just, like, says phone sex and yeah, just leaves it out there. He's trying to say that, like, we brought it up when it was him. Yep. Oh, my God. Oh, These guys are, like, in this room. Oh, my God. They're... Hello. Excuse Who's me? This? Hello. Who are you? Who are you? What? What? You heard me? What? Ha ha. Yeah, you're funny. Looking. Sex. Lazy R. Hi. Hello? Lazy R? Hey, hey, uh, I had a question. Yeah. Um, when's the last time you had sex? Oh my god. Kimbo Grand Front Desk, how can I help you? Grand Front Desk, how can I help you? Oh, hey lady. Hello? Hi, do you need something? Yes, there's a panther. There's a what? A panther. Hello. I better go walk. Hello. Hello. Is it the Barry Motel? May I, is it the Barry Motel? May I help you? You just call the Barry Motel. This is my cell phone. May I help you? Who are you? This is the Bell Air Motel. Somebody called the office, and I cannot answer the phone in the office, so I call back. What? Somebody called this number. Call the motel number. Ha ha. Thank you for calling the village of Steamboat. Barbara speaking. May I help you? Barbara speaking. May I help Barbara. Barbara. What? Hello? Barbara, there's a bobcat. There's a what? There's a bobcat. Where? I can hear it. Where is it? Under there. Under there. Under there where? Look under there. Well, I'm inside. It's right under there. It's under there. But where are you? And it has kittens. Are you on? Are you at the resort? Yes. Under what building? Under there. It's under there. All right. All right. What you need to do is back off. Back off, okay? Excuse me? You need to back off. No, you back off. You! Oh, you mean knock off the cat? I thought you were talking about me backing off you. No, no, no. You need to back away from the cat. You're, you're, you're disturbing it. It has. But I want. I want to pet the kitty. No, 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 no. Back away. Back away. Oh my God! Oh, get back, get, sir. Get, get but if it's not a friend, why is it friend shape? 
Okay, you need to back up. This is a wild animal. Leave it alone. But it's so cute. Sir, do you want me to call the police? I will call the police. No, because they're so cute. You don't have to. Stop walking up to it, sir. Stop walking up. Okay. I farted. Okay, great. Okay, I'm backing off. I'm I'm backing off. Back off. That boy just shit his pants because he's got damn wildcats. Oh, my God. Get back. I'm backing off. Back away. Keep backing away. Until it stops growling. I'm backing away. It's like... Okay. You're still disturbing it. I can still hear it. Okay. No, no, no. I'm not disturbing it. I swear it's just... Okay, hold on. You're too close. You're too close. No, I am not. You see the cute kitty. The cute kitty. I got a crank, a crank gun in my in my truck. I'll, I'm gonna get that for you, buddy. I'm gonna help you. Kitty, 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 kitty. Hold on, fool. Hey, one more, thing. one more thing. That's it. All right, listen. She go. I'm, I have finally hung up saying, I hope the Bob attacks them. Front desk, Barbara speaking. May I help you? Speaking, may I help you? Barbara, it's me. I have the Bob It's right here. You have what? The Bobcat is really nice and sweet. I'm petting it. You know, I need to put you on hold and answer the other line. Hold on, please. Okay. So where where are you? Are you at the resort? Are you here on site? Where are you located? There's like a street. There's like a street and. Yes. No, I've um. Okay. You you know you know that 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 bobcat can attack you and kill you. Did you know that? No, it can. It's tiny. I'm like ten times bigger than it. All right. Um, sir, I need I I need to know. I need to. Tame that there bobcat for you. Look at him now. I'm gonna go in close. Look, you see how I got my underpants and me hand like that? It's gonna distract him. Now them li- Hello? Hello? Excuse me? Who is this? Who are you? Um, I actually work at a hotel and I was calling this number back because it called the hotel. What? Uh, yeah. Ha ha. I'm so serious. We got a call from this number, and they said something about spiders being in their room. Oh, really? Because I can tell you right now, my husband... Your husband what? You have sat there and harassed me and harassed me on my show. What? Motherfucker, what the fuck, you punk ass bitch? Good evening. Thank you for calling the Sheridan Steamboat Resort Villas. My name is Riley. How may I assist? May I assist? Hey, Riley, baby. How are you doing tonight? I'm good. How are you? There's a bobcat. I'm sorry, what? There's a bobcat. Whoa, where? It's right there. there. 
where at? Where are you at? I'm I'm like a street. It's like right there. It's under there. I okay, but where are you at? It has kittens. It has kittens too, and I think that's why it's pissed. Where are you at? I'm on the street. Okay, but where on the street? Um, it's like the cross street by the base. By the base of the mountain? Yeah. I'm going to grab one. No. They're so cute. I'm going to grab one. Oh, oh shit. Mom. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Stand back. I got one. I got one. I got one. It's purring. Nice little pussy. Nice little pussy. Hey, pussy. I love you, little pussy. Oh, it's eating now. I'm, I'm, I just fed it. Oh, my leg. It's eating my leg. Why? Thank you for calling the Mantrams or Front Next. I'm Mansis. Hi. Hi. Um, no, no. Hang on just a second. I'm, uh, so I'm getting ready to head out for the night. Uh, I, have a, I have a date that's probably going to go a little late. Um, I'm leaving the cow tied up outside of my room. Could you, in the next couple of hours, go in and let it into the room so the bobcat can eat? Hello? Hello? Hi. I'm, I'm just letting you know I'm heading out for the rest of the night, and I've got the cow tied up to my door in my room. Can somebody let it in in, in like the next couple of hours so the bobcat can eat? Um, they're all off. What do you mean they're all off? I won't say that. You just you just pissed off my bobcat that's in my room. Sorry? Yeah. I have one on shift. You have to take a shit? What does that have to do with anything? No, I said I have no one on shift. Well, how's my bobcat going to eat? Because if he doesn't eat, he's probably going to rip the room up. I don't know. He's very temperamental when he doesn't have his, doesn't have his nom-noms. Well, I guess I got to stay home with him tonight then. No, here, talk to the bobcat. I like to kill deer. I taught the bobcat English. Ow, ow. See, he's he's angry because you're back talking. Why are you a back a back a talk? Somebody somebody is knocking. Someone's a knocking on my door. Hey, you're being too loud. Hey, I'll be like, oh, you come on, I'll open that door for you, and you'll fucking regret it. I'm going to go answer this door. Be quiet. Stupid cat. Ah, what do you want? Tina, attack. I think he died. Did he die? Oh my god, that cat's fucking him. Yeah, and, and now Tina, Tina the bobcat's a fucking him. What? <laughs> yeah, and some old lady's laughing. And she's enjoying it. <laughs> Isn't that right? Oh, Christian. Just like you're gonna be when I see you later, baby. Come on. See you later, just like you'll be, darling. Bye. What the fuck does that mean? 
Are you stupid? We both oh, she, this is the girl at the front. This is the girl at the front desk who was wearing the helmet. The one with the big ass hits. Yeah, the one with the one with the with the donut sized fucking stomach that hangs over her uvula. Hey, what's up, baby? You a torta or what? Uh, nah, 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 nah. She's showing her true colors now. <laughs> are you uh, are you acoustic? You want you want to come smoke drugs with us in our room and hallucinate about bobcats? Uh, da, 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 bobcats. Cat, stop talking. We're trying to do a call here. Da. Do you, do you just become French all of a sudden? I'll start off with a of talk. Au revoir. I don't, why, why am I getting turned on right now, the way she's talking? Ew! Good night. Have a great night. Don't call back. Please. <laughs> Please. Ah! Is this the one lady? Hello? Hello? Who is it? This, this is the hotel? The, yeah, this is the Bell M Hotel. You call my the office, but I'm not in the office. That's why I answer my cell phone. Oh, this this is the Bel Air? Yes, so. Like uh, on the TV show? What do you mean on the TV show? Bel Air? Bel Air Motel. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to bring a box of spiders. <laughs> what we, do you mean? There's a bobcat. Well, I'm going to bring a box of spiders down there. So I, I just use the name for who okay, I'm going to address you it better, to. You better stop calling like that. I'm going to report to the cops. Okay? But what about the spiders? No, 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 no. Please, I'm going no. to report to the cops right We're, now. You better stop. Okay? We love you. Stop it. Quality in. This is Ansley. Hello, Ansley? Yes. Does, does this extension exist? You're calling the Anthony? quality in in your ray? Yeah, I'm call I'm calling from the HR department. How you doing, Ansley? I'm doing good. How are you? I'm doing pretty good. Uh when's the last time you had sexual intercourse? Hello? Hey, buddy. Hey. Hello? Yep. Hey, can you hear me? I can. How can I help you? So, you know how you guys, like, um, put, like, cat food out in your guys' parking lot? No, we don't have a parking lot. Well, there's, like, cats, and I was eating, I was eating their cat food. Um, now they're following me. Hello? I'm eating their food and they're following me. Hello? Shut up! Hold on, I gotta beat somebody. What? I have to beat up my coworker. Can you, can you, can you, fuck can I put you on hold? Fuck. I'm gonna beat up my fuck coworker. Fuck. I wanna hear you, I wanna hear you, I wanna hear you fuck your coworker. Yo guys, it's a fight, get over here, watch around the windows. Um, no. Fuck him up. This cap was good. This cap was really good. Fuck him up. So which one's the funny one? Are you trying to be funny, or or what's? When do I get to talk no, to the funny okay, guy? Yeah, okay, dude. And and you're so funny. And you're so funny, right? You're gonna beat up your coworker. That was so funny, bro. You're the one calling me. I guess you got a lot of time to fucking waste. I'm sorry, we're calling, sir. I do, and what? I do, and what? Or you called me. I'm so dumb <laughs> that I can't even use a phone to call you. He's gone. Camel's Garden Hotel. <laughs> man, yo, we got you, dude. Sorry, your coworker, man, he had us call. You can pay me five bucks. I'm staying here to do it. We got you. Front desk, this is Julian. 
Hello? Isn't that a isn't that a woman's name? Julian, are you a girl? Julianne. Um, maybe I am, and I just haven't realized. Hi, Julian. It. How are you? He's a fucking oh. dirty dancer. Do you wear a little boy. dress? Do, do oh. you wear a little dress? Um, Look at big Julianne. Always got the fucking never, drink. Never considered uh, that, actually. Uh. Considered. Uh, hey guys, stop being bullies. Julian is my friend, and I love him very much. Is that your little boyfriend right there, Julian? Go fuck with you, man. Well, you can't. You can't handle your own problems. You gotta have your friend stand up to you. Fuck with my man, Jules, man. He's got his big black shirt. He got his drink. He's gonna fuck you up, man. The d- fucking dirty dancer ain't fucking no. I'm seeing. What's the matter, Julian? Julian? I like your butt. You scared, bro? You can't for yourself? Well, if it isn't Big Bad Julian. Thank you for calling my place. This is Amy. Can I help you? You, you Amy, actually, I have you a actually goddamn problem. I'm sorry? My husband wants to know if you own it. Because we're looking for the owner. We're pissed. I'm sorry? I, dude, I can't believe they put a fucking bobcat in here. I, I've got it trapped in the bathroom. There's a goddamn bobcat outside, and we brought it inside because it seemed cold. And this thing's pissed off, and its kittens came in, too. Okay. And we've been feeding in Doritos chips and Mountain Dew, and we don't know what else to give it. I think it's pissed off. Why you think? Why you think I'm a pussy? I can't handle it. I can't handle a bunch of cats. You you don't think I can handle a couple of cats? Okay, okay, okay. Um, man, me and my cousin were in the hotel. Me and my cousin were in the hotel, and we playing the Ouija board. And I don't know what's happening, but I keep hearing a guy talking to us. He's telling us he wants to kill a deer, man. Um, I don't want to tell you the room because we're playing the Ouija board to talk to demons. We, we're doing the spell to talk to demons. You, uh, and it actually you, worked, uh, man. Talking. There's a fucking demon right here. He's telling me he wants to kill the deer outside. Hello, what is it? I like to kill deer. Um, so me and my cousin, we stay in the hotel. Hello, lunch. Hello? Hello? Yes? Yeah, what's going on with this hotel? Yeah, it's just a normal lodge. Yeah, because I, cause I went into the uh, the broom closet and I got really pissed off and I started throwing around the cleaners. I got very pissed off. What's going on? Who pissed off? Me, me pissed off. I threw the window cleaner. Had a stroke from the call. Yeah, damn it. Ex- I'm sorry, excuse me? Yeah, damn it. Hello, can you hear me? Can you hear Hello? me? You see, what happened is, I don't know if you believe in God and Jesus and anything, but me and my friends in the hotel, we played with the Ouija board, and now there's all kinds of crazy shit going on. Tampons. I'll, I'll be pizza. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be you. Yeah, they're gross. Hello? I'm I'm missing tampons. Hello. Hey, yes. um we wanted a room tonight. Okay, come on in and I'll rent you one. Well, how much is it? Hundred and seventeen. For is that a big room with beds? There's a there's quite a bit of us. Oh, and it's too much. It's it's a room with one king bed. One king. Do you have any rooms with two? Yeah, but they're more expensive. Those are 135. 135. Well, okay then. Um, one sec. 
fucking deal. I'm just gonna check with uh, I'm gonna check with um, Elasma. He's the one that's gonna rent the room. So hold on, okay? I'm just gonna check with him really quick, okay? All right. Okay, one second. Hello. Elasma. Yep. He's on the phone. Um, he sounds like he's not gonna budge, but it's one thirty-five. Did you try? You tell them about the answer. Um, I I haven't. But what I was gonna let you do that. You're better at handling people like him. Talk him down. That? You ready? Here, I'm gonna transfer you back. Okay. Uh, all right. Yeah. Put him on. Okay. One, two, three. Hello. Hello. Hello, yes, I've been transferred to you uh, by my uh, my colleague here. Uh, what's the price you got there? Well, I quoted him a price for a single king bed of 117 and he wanted two queen beds, and that's 135 Okay, well, uh, all right, you know, uh, it's just, you know, it's two of us, you know, uh, we, we, we got, you know, not not much. Uh, like, can can you knock it down a little bit? Or like, we got triple A. You got triple A discount? Triple A will give you ten percent off. Hell yeah! All right, all right. That'll yeah, that'll be doable. All right. Uh, let me let me try. I got triple A. Let me yeah. Here, you take the phone. You talk to him. Give him the triple A number. Get that get that discount. Hey, and are you here, my sweetie? I'll, I'll just are you here, sweetie? Here. Hello. Yeah, I'm here already. You're here? Yep. And I'm motivated. Do you think just to let ourselves in the room, I'll I'll kick the door. (laughs) Wait, who the hell is this guy? No, you have to get out of here. I I ran out of the room. You can't be here. Yeah, just set it up over there. We need the sleeping bags and the and the cots over here. Um, bring in the portable bunk beds, please. They yeah, six over here, eight over here. Thanks, guys. Good job. Downtown Pizza. Okay. How may I help you? I'll see you when um, you get I have here. a pepperoni pizza. Nothing. Thank you for calling the Ribbon Center. It's tutorial. How may I help you? Hi, yeah. Aaron. How much is the room tonight? Uh, what kind of room are you looking for? Um, for me and my husband. Uh, so a single bed? D- a double, because we might have some friends. Okay, so our doubles are starting at one sixty. Um, okay. And you're looking at about one seventy seven with tax. Okay, um, can I, can you please hold on? Don't hang up. I gotta talk to him really quick. I'm gonna just, I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell him that really quick. So I'm gonna put you on a brief hold, okay? Okay. Okay. One how second. much does the how much does it cost? Elasma. Hello. Hi, Elasma. Hello. Um, Hi. She said it's gonna be like 160. She's on she's on hold right now. She can't hear us. Okay. Well, did you tell her about the the AAA and the uh, you know the the benefits card that that guy you know that guy I I had didn't in the in the church parking lot. He seemed pretty legit, you know. He said, "Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Just tell him, oh, I sent you over there, you know. And don't mention, you know, that he's on the list. I don't know what that meant, really, though." Oh. Like, Do you want me to transfer you to her so you can tell her? I don't know. You think she knows about the list? Because it sounds like. You don't want to I'm not sure. Because like, maybe I he don't. wants to work there and he's, you know, in trouble or something. I don't know. I don't know. She sounds kind of cute, to be honest. So I'm going to just transfer her to you, okay? Oh, okay, yeah. Okay. One, two, three. Hello? Hello? Um, just an FYI, I could hear all of you. Hello? What are you doing on my line? Hi. My husband was talking to you about renting You heard room. that? Yes, I heard all of that. 
Okay, I have the triple A card here. Will that okay. get us a discount? As long as the triple A card matches your ID. Oh, well, it's a trial card they gave me at at the shop. They said just they just didn't give you that. Here. They, they I didn't get my my, my permit one yet. It. Yeah, I didn't get the permanent one yet. It has it has my name and everything on it. It's just not the final one. It's the one that they But you're the one that said that the they website. got it yet you got it in the parking lot. I'm sorry? I like I said, I heard you guys' the entire conversation. Yeah, I was not muted. Honey, did you press did you did you mute did you forget to mute us? Oh shit. Honey, I, I told she you that. It's she okay, didn't Daddy. hear us. She, she was on hold. She didn't hear us. She's on hold. I well, did hear you. What are you talking about? But she didn't hear us. Lady. I pushed the and button. I pushed the button and you couldn't hear. Sh- you pressed the oh, button. Oh, God. Oh. Did you double press the button? Yeah. I... Oh, shit. No, I just pushed it once. Well, that's the problem then. Lady, um, you do have, you, you have an out. issue with that? You got really serious narcissism issues. Wait, who else is on the phone with you? Excuse me? Um, I got Dwight here, too. Oh, I don't need to... Who's that? Free up my vehicle insurance. I have no idea who that is. I thought was that guy was with you. Oh. Honey, are you cheating on me? No, baby, no. Cause I don't, I can't go through that again. Waffle House. Not again. Hello. I'd like um, <laughs> one egg. <laughs> What's up? Just think about all the good times you had, babe, and just not the one bad time where I cheated. Just remember right, how sorry I am. Go through some stuff. Uh, I'm gonna let you guys go so you can handle what you need to handle. Yeah, I, I'm gonna do you that. You can't too. talk to us. You're on hold, yeah. lady. You're on hold. Have a good night. Three. Yeah, I don't know what's going on here. I'm going to do it. I- I'm going to go. Yeah, hi, this is... Thank you for calling the Devin Supri. This is Aaron. How may I assist you? Damn. How do you let someone so cute as yourself answer a phone like that? Dude, that's just creepy. Can I help you? Yeah, I'm trying to book a room, like... I, I, but it's like next week. It's not like I don't need it immediately. That's what I'm saying. I said, we got time. We got time. So I'm looking for a single room. Uh, do they do single beds or you got to get a queen, a king? What do you got to do? We do have single queens. All right. All right. You're a queen. Uh, what? what day were you looking at? Uh, Tuesday? Hello? Yeah, can you hear me Tuesday? Yeah, so Tuesday you're looking at about 140, and then you're probably going to be about 150, give or take, with tax. Yeah, uh, what, what time do you work on Tuesday? I do not. Oh, I'm sorry. Do you work on Wednesday? We change out to Wednesday, my maybe? Schedule, dude. I'm not going to give you my Well, I just want to know where you were. Well, you just... Oh, you sound cute. I mean, I, I'm not trying to be creepy. Dude, I have a boyfriend. I'm not... Um, I have a boyfriend. I'm not well, dealing with that, okay? <gasps> Sometimes things change, and you go through changes in life, and I think you sound no. cute. What, what kind of a car do you drive? I'm going I'm not through telling changes. You that it's well, do, you don't, if you, do you have, no. like... Do you wear a size 8 I shoe, have, or... I have to go. What are you wearing right now? What are you wearing right? Well, what are you wearing right now? ET riders. Good evening. Thank you for calling. Is it Cross Keys? This is Melissa. Yes, hello. I found myself in a hole here. I'm outside, but I can't find my way out of it. Well, well, I I I can't understand what. Yes, I tripped here on the property, and I've fallen down. And I can't find my way out of this hole that I've fallen down into. 
Oh, are you speaking English? Oh, God. Yes. The Queen's English. You can't speak. I, okay, I can't. You're yelling. I can't understand anything you're saying. I, I fail and I can't get up. Thank you for calling Best Western Plus, Hood River Inn. How may I help you? Yes. Uh, how much is a room for tonight? For tonight? How many beds are you looking for? Yes. Preferably two. We got a couple people with us. Okay. Looks like all they have left is uh, river facing two queen beds. And those are two nineteen before tax. What tax would be two thirty nine eighty one? Two thirty nine eighty one. Can I put you on a on a brief hold real fast? I got to talk to my consultant right here to get the see if he can do that price really fast, please. Sure. That'll be, that'll be, one second. One second. Okay. okay. Elasma. Hello. Still yeah, I got the guy on hold right now. He can hear us, and I, he said it was two thirty nine, just about two thirty nine. Can you do that for two beds? Two thirty nine. Are you tell him about the discount, because I did the deal. I under didn't the tell him about the, the discount. Board. You know, the guy he, he came over. And he said, "Listen, I'll give you the cards. You just gotta, you know, take care of this for me." I took care of it for him. You know, that cat and dog. It'll never be seen no more. I took care. I'll transfer you to him. You tell him about the discount, okay? Uh, all right. Okay. One, two, three. Yeah. Uh, hello there. Hey. Sir. Yeah. Oh, yeah. We we got the discount card. What kind of discount card? Uh, it says Diner Vista. Uh, I don't believe that we take those. It's for the the hotel. It says we, we it does them all. Yeah, I've I've never uh, heard of I that. I had to do I had to do deeds. I didn't want to have to do to get the card. Well, you know, he was very convincing. Your employee out here in the parking lot. Well, he just so he said you gotta just take care of this dog and cat here. I don't have any employees out in the parking lot. Well, who's this guy here? He's here still. Let me put him on the phone. Here, he wants to talk to you. You take it. Hello? Hello? Jess, who is this? Do you, do you guys want a room or not? Um, I, I mean, you got transferred to me, man. How can I tell you? Okay. I'm, I'm done now. Have a good night. Hello. Hello. Excuse me? Who's this? Who are you? Who are you? What? You heard me. Ha ha. Ha ha. Who is this? Oh, really? Because I can tell you right now, my husband. Your husband what? Sucks dick? You have sat there and harassed me and harassed me on my show. Oh, you're smoking crack and this is a recording. You guys are retarded. You guys grow up. Motherfucker, what the fuck, you punk ass bitch? What the fuck, bitch ass boy? Uh huh. Yeah, really, bitch. What? You fucking loser. And that would be you. <laughs> yeah, whatever. Uh, yeah, whatever. Meet me up somewhere and we'll see what you are, you little bitch. Yeah, hit me up, motherfucker, because you did last night, bitch. Mother I know I'm a motherfucker. Who the about. fuck are you? Who the fuck are you, bitch? You a bitch boy. Goofy son of a bitch. You're a fucking bitch boy. You're a fucking illiterate. You got a fucking degree, because I got a fucking degree. Yeah, a degree on what? Fucking dick? I don't give a fuck where you're from, bitch. I don't give a fuck where you're from, bitch boy. Yeah, you got a fucking degree from fucking... 
from fucking uh uh what what you gonna say there, Buttercup? It's Some bullshit retarded. fucking online. Yeah, fucking faggot ass bitch. What? You're a faggot ass bitch. You heard what I said? If you think you're bad, why don't you fucking talk to me then, boy? I am talking to you, bitch. And what you gonna do about it? Not a fucking thing. Let's go do something about a it. Bitch. Cause you're a bitch. You're talking that's shit. What, that's what a bitch boy do. Sit there and fucking play with his dick. A bitch boy. You're talking shit. You can't back it up, motherfucker. Oh, well, motherfucker, I can back it up way more than you fucking can, bitch boy. Because I a fucking said, joke. I'm going to tell you right now, nope. buddy. I'm not a buddy. And sure the fuck not your buddy, bitch. Don't get a fucking life. Get a life, you fucking bitch. Oh, you can't take it? You can dish it out, but you can't take it, huh? Fuck you. Call my motel again, bitch, and see what happens. Hello? Hello? Excuse me? Did you have a problem with spiders? Who are you? That's the th- same thing I'm wondering. What? It's okay. I got what I needed. Thank you.